So my fortune says you have the ability to overcome obstacles on the way to success. Hey guys, it is week three, or episode three, of How to Eat Out and Lose Weight. It should be called How to Eat Junk Food and Lose Weight. Each week I visit a different restaurant and I choose signature foods on the menu and show you how to eat real food and still lose weight. Most people fail at diets because they're eating restrictive foods. They're eating foods they don't like. They're eating foods that they can't, that they actually have to stay home and make. They're not eating what's available to them in their real everyday life. Next week, I will be doing the last in the series for the fast food section. And then the following week, I will be starting with bar food options and how to eat out on a Friday night after you've had a long day or a long week at work. So in talking to my viewers this week, one of them actually said to me, hey, I tried your first episode and what you suggested to eat at McDonald's and unfortunately, I was still starving, she said. Well, that is because when we order out, when we eat out, most of the dishes that are brought to you are two to three serving sizes. They're not single serving foods. So you have to cut everything down to about a third, sometimes in half, depending on the food, in order to eat a normal portion size. It is gonna take some time for your body to adjust to eating smaller portions. You will be hungry in the beginning because you're not eating as much. You're not filling up on as much fat. You're not filling up as, up on as much fillers. So you need to decide, do you want to be on a restrictive diet and eat foods that you don't really enjoy? lose a little bit of weight and then fail because you don't enjoy the food you're eating? Or do you want to eat out with real life food, still lose your weight, and actually enjoy the stuff that you're eating and not have to tell your friends, no, I can't eat there. I can't eat there because um, it's not on my diet. Well, diets don't work. Learning how to eat. So you can learn how to cheat is my motto. If you need help figuring out your numbers or some more specifics on how to do that, go ahead and put a comment in the comment box below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. When I eat out, I try to keep my menu, my meals anywhere between three and 500 calories, depending on my activity level for the day. This week, I am actually at Panda Express, and that was requested by May. Um, the McDonald's comment was actually put out by Anna. Thank you, Anna, for mentioning that you're so hungry, because I'm sure a lot of people still struggle with that. And May, thank you for suggesting Panda Express as our week number three for fast food series. Once again, if you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave those in the comment section below. If you have someone that struggles with fast food or with eating out and losing weight, then share this video with them. Pass it along. It's always easier to accomplish something when you know you're not the only one struggling. As you can see, I chose some signature foods off the menu. I chose Crab Rangoon, um, a small Coke. Once again, their idea of small is like 20 ounces. Um, so I'm only gonna drink a quarter of this. 
And then I got hen pie chicken for my protein and um, fried rice um, as my side. On their board, it says that a bowl like this can range anywhere from 390 calories all the way up to 1,000 calories. So I'm not going to eat the whole thing. You know I'm not going to eat the whole thing. And I'm only actually going to eat two of the crab rangoon to show you the difference in the calorie counts as we go. So if I had to say, in one of these rice bowls, the entree of the Kung Pao chicken is probably four to five ounces. That includes the vegetables and the chicken. There's peanuts in there. As far as the fried rice goes, I'm guessing that's about two and a half three cups. I only need to have half a cup of rice in any serving for any type of food. So I really will only eat about half a cup of the rice, two of the crab rangoon, like I said, um, and I'll eat most of the chicken and vegetables because it's just chicken and vegetables. This is not fried, it's grilled. It's grilled. You can see I have most of my rice left, my crab rangoon, and I only drank part of my soda. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions and or suggestions for some place for me to try next, go ahead and let me know. I hope you guys have a great week, and I will see you soon. Bye.